What's up peeps, Mwahaha coming at you with some Clash Royale replay action. I gotta share these with you guys because these are some of the craziest matches I've been in over the last couple of days. So on this match you're gonna see one of the most ridiculous bugs I've seen yet with Sparky and it ends up costing me the game. You're not going to believe this when you see it. I didn't believe it when I saw it. I didn't know what the heck was going on, but you'll see as it's coming up. Uh, so my opponent here playing a balloon deck, and uh, of course I got my Royal uh, Royal Thunder deck. A super strong deck, and it's been doing very well. It took me, uh, this season took me over 4,000. took me to 4,008, I think. And uh, we're gonna, I'm going to show you the last game I played of the season, which ended up taking me there, and it was a crazy game. Um, but you can see, so this guy's playing uh, Prince and um, a Balloon. So a little bit different. Usually right now we're seeing a lot of Giant Balloons, uh, or we're seeing Lava Hound Balloons, but uh, have not uh, typically seen the Prince Balloon. Uh, it seems to work pretty decent for him, but... Um, as you'll see coming up, it's not really his deck that wins this hand. I think I could have turned it around with uh, Sparky, Royal Giant, uh, at right about this point. But watch what happens with Sparky on this. This is crazy. I've never seen anything like this before. If you guys have, please let me know in the comment section below. Watch this. This is nuts. So here comes Sparky. He could zap right now. Well, he zaps on uh, the Barbarians. But look, what the heck is he doing? He's like, oh, I don't want to. He's possessed. I, he could have zapped that. Uh, he could have zapped that uh, wizard, and this would be a totally different game. Totally different game. What in the world? So uh, I, I don't know what's going on with that, but uh, I am definitely going to post this video in uh, the forums, the uh, Clash Royale forums for the bug reports, because uh, that that is craziness. Uh, as you know, when you're playing Royal Giant, once you break through and you have uh, you have a, a little bit of territory on your opponent's side, it's pretty much GG. Like you've you've got a huge advantage. That would have opened it up for me right there, uh, but because of that Sparky bug, I ended up losing that one and uh, not too stoked about that. All right, next video. All right, so this is the one I was just telling you about. This was the uh, the last game I played last season. You can see I'm going up against a level t what, level bleh, 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 level 12. Um, but honestly, when you look at his cards and the level of his cards, the guy is like, he is way up in 12. He is probably almost 13. You can see there he's got level 13 archers coming in, level 13 bomber coming in. What's his barbs? Level 13 barbs coming in. So, I mean, this guy's deck is maxed. Uh, pretty close to... Well, I think the deck he's playing in this round is maxed. Level 13 fire spirits. So, um, I'm seeing this coming in. I'm like, oh, come on. I'm just trying to get over 4,000. Please. And uh, we'll see what happens. You can see at this point you're thinking, or at least I was thinking, man, I'm toast right now. The guy's already got my king tower down halfway. He's already got one... Of my uh, one of my not my whatever my crown towers down, and uh, I've barely got anything on his right tower. Oh man, I thought this was gonna be it. So all right, this is what I'm talking about in the last video where Sparky, Sparky Royal Giant will turn some stuff around. He drops Royal Giant at this point, and I'm like, oh man, it's over. Uh, but I got the Ice Wizard and the Mini Pika down. The Ice Wizard Mini Pekka, phenomenal counter to the Royal Giant. Uh, you can see also his Royal Giant 13 as well. And so Sparky's coming in. I didn't have enough elixir to put down my Royal Giant, so I had to put down Knight. Knight did a good job of tanking uh, that tower so that Sparky could get in. At this point, I've made a breakthrough. I'm going to go ahead and put that Royal Giant on his territory and uh, start working down on his tower. I put him a little too far forward, and the King Tower is actually getting damage on him. So uh, I thought at this point, well, now between the, the level advantage, between how I just played that, he's going to definitely win. And uh, so I start pushing left here just to try to keep somebody off of my King Tower. I'm thinking at this point, he's going to drop a Royal Giant or something on my King Tower, and it's going to be done. So I got to get Sparky down to try to take care of that. And you can see he put some cheap troops down right there, and then his Barbarians to try to, uh, the cheap troops to just get the zap out of Sparky, and then the Barbarians to try to counter Sparky. 
Unfortunately, the Barbarians focus the Ice Wizard, not Sparky, and between the Ice Wizard and my Fire Spirits, it leaves Sparky untouched. Sparky is there to help out with my Royal Giant. At this point, I'm thinking, man, okay, I'm gonna get the second tower down. All I gotta do is hang on for 30 seconds. But look at my mini P.E.K.K.A. He makes it through to the King Tower for the clutch play. And between that, my Knight, and my Royal Giant, it's GG. I take out a level 12, really a level 13 masquerading as a level 12, to win this season and come out at 4,008 trophies. All right, guys, and the last one for today, um, this one, a big time nail biter. You can see looking at his deck already, he's playing the balloon deck, very strong uh, today, based on today's current meta and whatever the buffs are and the nerfs are and everything. That balloon deck can be real dangerous. He's gonna go barb balloon push. All I've got right now is the knight out to try to distract those barbs. I'm low on elixir because I got that collector down early, but I'm gonna freeze that, uh, or I'm gonna slow down that balloon with my ice wizard and get uh, those fire spirits in there to do some additional damage. The barbs are gonna focus on that elixir collector, and look, even though the balloon just about got there, and he had those barbs also, only 2,876, my tower damage, my tower did not take very much damage. I'm gonna be able to do just about that much with my ice wizard alone on the left tower, and now I've got that sparky down, and he's gonna start climbing the right side, which means my opponent with a very difficult decision. Do I push right? and uh, try to defend against this uh, Sparky, or do I continue pushing left on the tower I've already started working on? Ice Wizard Sparky and Royal Giant is just tough to deal with. I go ahead and put down the Fire the uh, fire Spirit to take care of that Princess, and now that dreaded Giant Balloon Push. At this point, I've decided either I've gotta go for three crown or nothing. And you can see I'm doing some work there, but he does manage to get his barbs down, and the barbs are gonna even things up quite a bit. My, t my tower is in damage range. He starts taking it down. He's got giant and balloon on my tower. I've got his down to 192, but he's got minions. Can the knight get there to do it in time? He gets in for one hit at the end with barely any health left. My king tower at 15 health. Can you believe it? The closest match I think I've played. Let's watch that one more time. That knight deserves MP MVP. He uh, he took all the damage and got to the tower for that final hit. That was just a crazy nail biting match, and uh, I just uh, I was shocked by that. So uh, let me know what you guys think of the videos uh, or the uh, replays in the comment section below. And uh, if you're not already doing so, please go over and check out the Twitch uh, my Twitch channel at Twitch TV slash Muahaha Martin. We are doing a lot of tourneys over there. Uh, tournaments tonight, uh, tournaments last night, tournaments tonight starting at 9 p.m. Eastern Time. And we usually go until uh, about 11 o'clock Eastern Time. We try to get two tournaments in. We're looking at about a 200-man tournament tonight. We ran 120s last night. We may go bigger if we can fill up those tournaments fast, uh, indicating that there's enough demand to do it. But uh, I hope to see you guys there. I hope you like the replays. Let me know in the comments section below, and I'll see you guys next time. This is Mwahaha, out. You're still here? It's over. Click the subscribe button and pick another one of these videos. Well, go on. What are you waiting for? I don't have anything great to show you. Just click the subscribe button. All right. You've given me no choice. <clears throat> Don't say I didn't warn you. I could do this all day. Click the subscribe button and choose another video. Whenever you're ready. Whenever you're ready.
All right, well, it's been fun. I'm just, I'm gonna go now.